This video is the final part of the DIY Dolly Assemble series. Before you begin, make sure that you have all your electronics, parts and tools. Step 1. Install the I module. Connect the speaker connectors and make sure that they are properly connected. Insert the touch sensor pad into the specified location, under the head shell. There is a little bit of a learning curve here, so please be patient. Make sure that eye module is in line with the body surface. Step 2. Install the front bumper. Connect the bumper flat cable to the connector using tweezers and lock the connector. The next step is to combine the bumper and main body gently, starting from the top side and working your way down. After aligning the holes, secure the front bumper to the main body with two 4mm screws. Step 3. Install the battery. Insert the battery as shown and press gently to set into position. Step 4. Install the motherboard. The marked arrows located on the board indicate cable connector locations. One for I module, two for drive motors, servo and fan, the other servo, and the battery connector. Start with connecting the battery connector. Connect the fan connector. Connect to the right servo connector. Connect the left servo connector. Be sure to cross the I.O. cable to the other side before connecting the front cables. It is recommended that you use tweezers for connecting all the flat cables. The main body should now be secured with a 6mm screw for a temporary period of time. Step 5. Install the wheels and arms. Insert the front wheels into the drive shaft by pushing. Insert a washer between the wheel and the body before mounting the rear wheel. Mount the rear wheel as shown and add a second washer. Be sure to select the correct sidearm and cover before making alignment.
Now insert the flat cable to the specified location. Align the arm to the limiter end as close as possible. Once you recognize the correct position for the servo arm, gently insert it into the servo tooth. Attach the arm with the 16mm screw without tightening it. Connect the arm flat cable using tweezers. Secure the rear wheel with a 5mm screw. Check the rear wheel is spinning freely. Now tighten the arm screw as tight as you can. Secure the track cover with two 5mm screw. The same process should be repeated on the other side as well. Step 6. Install the bottom lid. Apply a small piece of double-sided tape to the power button as shown. Or you could use glue. This will help prevent falling while closing the bottom lid. Align the power button and bond it as shown. Before mounting the lid make sure that you remove the temporary screw. Secure the lid with four screws. Two 20mm screws for the front and two 10mm screws for the rear.
Step 7. Install Tracks. Ensure that the arm position is up before installing tracks. The front guiding teeth should be installed before the rear side. Repeat this process for the other track. In the final step, align the I.O. lid to the body and close it. Congratulations, the DIY Dolly assembly is complete.